Our universe is filled with celestial wonders that captivate and challenge our understanding. Among these, supermassive black holes stand out as some of the most intriguing objects known to science. These gravitational behemoths, millions to billions of times the mass of our sun, lurk at the centers of galaxies, including our own Milky Way. Their immense gravitational pull warps the fabric of space-time, creating regions where the laws of physics break down. Thanks to the James Webb Space Telescope, we are finally beginning to shed light on these enigmatic objects. Imagine a telescope so powerful that it can detect the faintest whispers of light from the most distant corners of the universe. That telescope is the James Webb Space Telescope, revolutionizing our understanding of the universe, including supermassive black holes. The JWS is a marvel of engineering, a testament to human ingenuity and our insatiable thirst for knowledge. Its primary mirror spans over 21 feet and is composed of 18 hexagonal segments that work in perfect unison to collect light from the cosmos. It is equipped with state-of-the-art instruments designed to dissect and analyze the light it collects, revealing the composition, temperature, and motion of celestial objects with unprecedented detail. One key instrument is the near-infrared camera, capable of observing the universe in infrared light, a wavelength range invisible to the human eye. This infrared capability is crucial for studying supermassive black holes because it allows astronomers to peer through the thick clouds of gas and dust that often surround these cosmic behemoths. Infrared light can penetrate these veils, revealing the hidden secrets within. Deep within the swirling chaos of every major galaxy lies a sleeping giant, a supermassive black hole, its immense gravity holding the galaxy together. These gravitational titans are dynamic entities, influencing the evolution of their host galaxies in profound ways. Supermassive black holes are not directly visible, as their gravitational pull is so strong that not even light can escape their grasp. However, their presence is revealed by the behavior of the material swirling around them. As gas and dust fall towards the black hole, they form an accretion disk, a swirling vortex of superheated matter that emits intense radiation across the electromagnetic spectrum. This radiation provides astronomers with a glimpse into the extreme environment surrounding a supermassive black hole. By studying the properties of this radiation, astronomers can infer the mass, spin, and activity level of the black hole itself. The JWS, with its exceptional sensitivity and resolution, is providing astronomers with an unprecedented view of these galactic hearts. In the vast expanse of the cosmos, there are objects so luminous that they outshine entire galaxies, their light traveling billions of years to reach our telescopes. These cosmic beacons are known as quasars, powered by the intense activity surrounding supermassive black holes in the early universe. Quasars are among the most distant and energetic objects ever observed. They are thought to be powered by the accretion of matter onto supermassive black holes at the centers of young galaxies. As matter falls into the black hole, it releases an enormous amount of energy, illuminating the surrounding gas and dust and creating a blindingly bright object. The JWST, with its ability to observe the universe in infrared light, is providing new insights into the nature of quasars and the early universe. Its high sensitivity allows it to detect fainter and more distant quasars than ever before, pushing our observational limits closer to the epoch of their formation. By studying the properties of these early quasars, astronomers hope to gain a better understanding of the processes that govern the formation and growth of supermassive black holes in the early universe. Imagine a cosmic lighthouse, its beams so powerful that it can warp the very fabric of space-time. That is the essence of a gravitational lens, a phenomenon predicted by Einstein's theory of general relativity, where the gravity of a massive object such as a supermassive black hole, bends and magnifies the light from objects behind it. Gravitational lensing is a powerful tool for astronomers, allowing them to study objects that would otherwise be too faint or distant to observe. When a massive object, such as a supermassive black hole, aligns perfectly with a more distant object, its gravity acts as a cosmic lens, bending and magnifying the light from the background object. The JWS, with its exceptional sensitivity and resolution, is poised to revolutionize the study of gravitational lensing. Its infrared vision allows it to peer through the dust and gas that often obscure visible light, revealing lensed objects in unprecedented detail. 
By studying the properties of these lensed objects, astronomers can map the distribution of mass in the lensing galaxy, including the presence of dark matter. Galaxies, those majestic islands of stars scattered throughout the cosmos, are not static entities frozen in time. They are dynamic and ever-evolving, shaped by a complex interplay of gravitational forces, star formation, and the enigmatic influence of supermassive black holes lurking at their cores. Galaxy mergers, colossal cosmic collisions between these stellar metropolises, are among the most dramatic events in the universe. These mergers can trigger bursts of star formation, reshape galactic structures, and fuel the growth of supermassive black holes at their centers. As galaxies collide, their gravitational fields intertwine, stirring up the gas and dust within them. This turbulent maelstrom can funnel vast amounts of material towards the supermassive black holes, igniting a feeding frenzy that releases enormous amounts of energy. The JWS, with its ability to observe the universe in infrared light, is providing astronomers with a front row seat to these cosmic collisions. The universe in its infancy was a vastly different place than the cosmos we observe today. It was a hot, dense soup of elementary particles, expanding and cooling in the aftermath of the Big Bang. Over eons, this primordial soup coalesced into the first stars and galaxies, lighting up the universe and seeding it with the elements necessary for life. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its unparalleled sensitivity and infrared vision, is a time machine, allowing us to peer back billions of years to witness the universe in its infancy. Its primary mission is to detect the faint glow of these first stars and galaxies, providing us with a glimpse into the epoch of cosmic dawn. By studying the properties of these first stars and galaxies, astronomers hope to answer fundamental questions about the early universe. The existence of supermassive black holes raises a fundamental question. How did these cosmic giants form in the first place? Several theories attempt to explain their formation. One theory suggests they formed from the collapse of massive clouds of gas and dust in the early universe. Another theory proposes that supermassive black holes formed from the mergers of smaller black holes. The JWS, with its ability to observe the early universe, is providing astronomers with valuable data to test these theories. By studying the properties of early galaxies and the supermassive black holes at their centers, astronomers hope to determine which formation scenario is most likely. Galaxies are organized into a vast cosmic web shaped by the gravitational pull of dark matter. Supermassive black holes residing at the nodes of this cosmic web play a crucial role in the evolution of galaxies and the structure of the universe itself. Their immense gravitational pull influences the distribution of matter, shaping the formation of galaxies and galaxy clusters. The JWS, with its ability to observe the universe in infrared light, is providing astronomers with a new perspective on the cosmic web and the role of supermassive black holes in its evolution. Its infrared vision allows it to penetrate the dust and gas that often obscure visible light, revealing the faint glow of distant galaxies and the intricate details of the cosmic web. The James Webb Space Telescope, with its groundbreaking capabilities, has ushered in a new era of astronomical discovery. Its observations are revolutionizing our understanding of the universe, from the formation of the first stars and galaxies to the enigmatic nature of supermassive black holes. JWS's legacy will extend far beyond its operational lifespan. The data it collects will provide astronomers with a treasure trove of information to analyze for decades to come leading to new discoveries and a deeper understanding of the cosmos. The quest to understand the universe is a never-ending journey, and the James Webb Space Telescope is a testament to the power of human curiosity and our relentless pursuit of knowledge. Despite the remarkable progress made possible by the James Webb Space Telescope, many questions about supermassive black holes remain unanswered. These enigmatic objects continue to challenge our understanding of the universe, beckoning us to explore further into the unknown. One of the most fundamental questions is, what happens inside a black hole? The singularity at the center of a black hole, where gravity becomes infinitely strong and the laws of physics as we know them break down, remains a mystery. Some theories suggest that the singularity could be a gateway to other universes or dimensions, while others propose that it could be a point of infinite density and zero volume. 
The journey to understand these cosmic behemoths is far from over. But with each new discovery, we come closer to unraveling the secrets of the universe and our place within it.